Welcome back guys. Today I have a Kroger a grocery delivery. It was about $90 and some change for everything you see here. I already have it divided up between food and non-food so I'm too lazy to do the math to find the grand total but you can do the math if you want when I show you the numbers here in just a second. So I spent $74.81 on food items, which brings my total for the month up to $220.15 and leaves me with $154.85 for groceries. And then I spent $17.10 on non-food items this week at Kroger, which leaves me with just $1.30 in non-food items remaining. So let me go ahead and show you what I got. First up, the only non-food items I got were, I got two of these packs of sparkle paper towels. They were, I believe, $7.99 a piece when you bought these. So I got two of those just to stock us back up on paper towels. Up here I got two boxes, two packs of the Yoohoo. Are they healthy? No. But my kid has, kids haven't had them in a really long time and they were only $2 and I think 79 cents each. So I bought one strawberry and one chocolate. I got two boxes of these dark chocolate peanut and almond nature valley bars and I believe I get a dollar cash back from Kroger for buying those. I got two avocados that are hopefully good because these little tiny avocados are a dollar fifty. The Pop Tarts Hot Fudge Sunday were a best customer bonus and they were free. I got one bag of donuts, the old fashioned kind, one thing of street tacos, my middle daughter has asked to have pork tacos last week next week so that's why we got the avocados because we've been using guacamole cups but i want to make real guacamole for the pork street tacos and everybody likes street tacos so i'll need almost this whole pack of tortillas to make tacos for my family i also got two loaves of bread i got Two three pound packages of ground beef. These were on sale for, I believe it was $11.97 this week. I got one bag of Angus beef meatballs. We use those for meatball subs. This was a substitution that I didn't want. I ordered the Rally's fries, the Sonic's tots, and the Arby's fries, and all of them were out of stock. They would have been $2.99 a bag. This is almost $4 for this bag. It's $3.69, I believe. And I said I didn't want it because I knew it would cost more than what I did order. I got this box of donuts. It was on their flash sale for like $1.60, so I went ahead and picked that up. Each of my kids will get two of those. I got a thing of cornstarch because my middle daughter used up the last of our cornstarch trying to do a little um, experiment where you make prehistoric slime, but she didn't read the directions, so she added all the water instead of just a little bit, and she used up the last of the cornstarch we had, so I picked up one of those. I got a can of baked beans. This huge thing of basically generic Nutella was $3.99. These raspberries, obviously they're missing some. It's because they were very moldy right there. So they did refund me on these, plus they overcharged me. These were supposed to be $2.99 a piece. But they charged me five dollars and some change a piece five nine four ninety nine a piece they were part of their flash sale as well i got three ears of corn to have with burgers and brats some tomatoes on the vine for sandwiches or snacking or whatever a watermelon which was supposed to be 2.99 because it was also part of their flash sale and i took a i always take a screenshot of my order when i place it with the coupons so i know what was supposed to be what, but they charged me $5.99 for that, so I did go ahead and refund that as well. I got two pounds of strawberries. These were $4.99, but I just noticed that they're moldy, so I will have to tell them that my strawberries are also moldy. I mean, I know fruit, fruit molds pretty quickly, but I literally just got these like three hours ago. They shouldn't be moldy yet. Head of lettuce for sandwiches or tacos or whatever. One big broccoli crown. And then these grapes were a substitution. I ordered the gumdrop grapes and they gave me just regular green grapes. 
So whatever, that's fine. We have grapes for this week as well. And I think I missed the cantaloupe. This was a dollar seventy-nine, I believe it was. That was also a part of the flash sales when I checked out. So that is everything I got in this Kroger grocery delivery for actually it's ninety one ninety. One. 91 91 for everything here. I just did the math for you. This was $91.91 total. These packs of ground beef will be divided up into about one pound packages and put in the freezer, probably for tacos or sloppy joes, maybe even chili since the weather is supposed to be cool off here soon because fall is coming. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell notification to get notifications when I post new videos. And until next time, we'll be seeing you. Bye, guys.